Definition of definition is a statement expressing the essential nature of something. But why is definition so important? Because definitions enable us to have a common understanding of a word or a subject. They allow us to be on the same page when discussing or reading about an issue. Anthropology is a discipline which serves the infinite curiosity about human beings. Many scholars have given their understanding of the subject from 5th century BC. By understanding all their definitions, we will be able to learn the growth of the subject over the time. For the genesis of systematic thinking, we usually refer back to the classical Greek civilization, especially to the writings of Herodotus in 5th century BC. Not only Herodotus, many other Greek and Roman historians, namely Socrates, Aristotle, Plato, etc., are considered as pioneer social thinkers. Aristotle defined anthropology as gossip that revolves around human and anthropologist as the gossiper who talks about himself. In the 4th century BC, the Roman philosopher Lucretius, in his book on the nature of things, discoursed on the origin of religion, the arts, language and the division of labor. It was during 16th century that anthropology came into philosophical faculties of Germany and was defined as systematic study of man as physical and moral beings. From 16th century to the beginning of 19th century, anthropology remained within the province of philosophy. The 18th century German philosopher Immanuel Kant wrote a book entitled Anthropology in 1789, suggesting the animal origin of man. He described anthropology as study which describes and explains the animal origin, social as well as cultural development and progress of man. He for the first time identified that man had an animal origin and man's biological complexity is the result of evolution. In 19th century, Edward Bernard Tyler in his epoch-making book Primitive Culture defined culture in the following words. Culture or civilization is that complex whole which includes knowledge, beliefs, arts, morals, law, customs and any other capabilities and habits acquired by man as a member of society. In context of empirical studies, we must mention the contributions of 20th century anthropologists like Franz Boas, Alfred Plutke Brown, Kroeber, Malinowski, Margaret Mead, Ruth Benedict and many others. Here are some definitions given by anthropologists in 20th century. Jacob and Stern said, Anthropology is the scientific study of the physical, social and cultural development and behavior of human beings since their appearance on this earth. Hertzkowitz said, Anthropology is the study of man and his actions. Malinowski defined anthropology as study of man at all levels of development. We can see how definitions and understandings of anthropology changed over time from gossip to philosophy to biological origin to scientific study. But how this subject even emerged in academics or in research field? Well, that will be another topic for another Think Anthropologically session. Till then, take care and keep learning.